ever wondered where the name Canada comes from? Does it mean something in French or something else entirely? Perhaps. Did you know the dark reality of Canada's residential schools that no one is talking about? Bet you didn't. So, let's dive into the fascinating world of Canada and uncover these strange and weird facts you might not have known. No time to waste, let's get started. Number 51, Origins of Canada. The name Canada originates from the indigenous Huron Iroquois word, Kanata, meaning village. French explorer Jacques Cartier first recorded the term in 1535, and it gradually expanded to encompass the entire region. The name was officially adopted for the newly formed Dominion of Canada in 1867. Number 50. Geography of Canada Canada is located in North America and covers an area of 9.98 million square kilometers, making it the second largest country in the world. Sharing the longest international border with the United States, Canada is a land of breathtaking natural beauty. Number 49. Population. As of 2024, Canada has about 38 million residents across 10 provinces and three territories, with Ontario being the most populous province. The gender ratio is nearly equal, with approximately 50.4% women and 49.6% men. Number 48. Currency. The currency of Canada is Canadian dollar. It has been in use since 1858, replacing the Canadian pound. It has special tactile features for vision-impaired individuals. One US dollar equals around 1.38 Canadian dollars today. Number 47. National flag. Canada's national flag, adopted on February 15, 1965, showcases a red maple leaf at its center, symbolizing unity and nature. The flag also features two vertical red bands on the sides, with a white field in between. Number 46. Languages. Canada has more than 200 languages spoken, including 60 indigenous languages. The two official languages of Canada are English and French, but English is the majority language in every province and territory, except Quebec and Nunavut. Number 45. History of Canada. Canada's history spans millennia, starting with indigenous civilizations and continuing through European exploration. France ceded control to Britain, and in 1867, four colonies united to form the Dominion of Canada. By 1982, Canada achieved full sovereignty and now comprises 10 provinces and three territories. Number 44, Indigenous People. Indigenous peoples, First Nations, Inuit, and Métis make up about 5% of Canada's population. Their rich cultural traditions, languages, and spiritual beliefs have significantly shaped the nation's history and continue to be celebrated. Number 43. Inuit Art Collection. Canada houses the world's largest collection of Inuit art, featuring traditional carvings, prints, and textiles, preserved and showcased in museums like the Winnipeg Art Gallery and the Canadian Museum of History. Number 42. Immigration. Canada is one of the most welcoming countries for immigrants, with a long history of immigration shaping its diverse population. The country has ambitious immigration targets, aiming to admit hundreds of thousands of new permanent residents annually to address labor shortages and population growth. Number 41. Ethnicities. Canada's cultural tapestry includes indigenous peoples, French and British settlers, and the immigrants from Asia, Africa, and Latin America. This diverse blend shapes Canada's dynamic and inclusive society. Number 40. The Capital City. Ottawa, Canada's capital since 1857, is known for historic Parliament Hill and the scenic Rideau Canal, a UNESCO World Heritage Site. Parliament Hill features iconic Gothic Revival buildings, while the Rideau Canal offers boating in summer and ice skating in winter. Number 39. Maple Syrup Canada is the undisputed king of maple syrup production, contributing to over 78% of the global supply in 2022, with Quebec being the largest producer, 
accounting for 92% of Canada's total, making it a cornerstone of the region's economy and culture. Number 38, literacy rate. Canada boasts an impressive literacy rate exceeding 99%, a testament to its robust education system. This high level of literacy is a cornerstone of the country's social and economic development, providing its citizens with the skills necessary to thrive in the modern world. Number 37, Canada and Hollywood. Canada has a rich history of producing world-class talent, from Jim Carrey's comedy to Celine Dion, Drake and Justin Bieber's vocals, and actors like Ryan Reynolds and Chris Evans, many stars proudly maintain their Canadian heritage, shaping their careers and public image. Number 36, Basketball's Origin. Canadian-born James Naismith is credited with inventing basketball in December 1891 while working as a physical education instructor at the YMCA Training School in Springfield, Massachusetts. His creation of this team sport has since captivated millions of fans worldwide. Number 35, healthcare wait times. Canada's publicly funded healthcare system is often praised, but it faces challenges with wait times for elective procedures and specialist consultations, averaging about 28 weeks in 2023, which has been a subject of ongoing public debate and policy discussions. Number 34, residential schools. Canada's dark history includes the residential school system, which removed over 150,000 Indigenous children from their families between the late 1800s and 1996. These children suffered severe physical, emotional, and sexual abuse in institutions designed to erase Indigenous cultures. The discovery of around 1,300 unmarked graves at former school sites has sparked national reflection. In 2022, Pope Francis apologized for the Catholic Church's role in this tragedy. Number 33, Longest Coastline. Canada has the world's longest coastline, stretching over 202,000 kilometers. It is bordered by the Atlantic, Pacific, and Arctic Oceans, which contribute to its extensive and diverse maritime landscape. This vast coastline includes numerous bays, inlets, and islands, Number 32, forest coverage. Canada's forests cover 347 million hectares of land, which is about 40% of the country's land mass and 9% of the world's forests. This makes Canada the third most forested country in the world by area, and Canadians have more forest area per person than most other countries. Number 31, moose population. Canada boasts the world's largest moose population, with over a million of these majestic creatures roaming its vast wilderness. Primarily found in the boreal forests and the province of Newfoundland and Labrador, moose are an iconic symbol of Canada's natural heritage. Number 30, Polar Bear Capital. Churchill, Manitoba is renowned as the polar bear capital of the world. Every autumn, thousands of tourists flock to this remote Canadian town to witness the extraordinary spectacle of polar bears congregating on the shores of Hudson Bay. Number 29, Canada's nightlife. Canada's nightlife is as diverse as its landscapes, with bustling cities like Toronto, Vancouver, and charming Quebec City offering trendy clubs, cozy pubs, live music, and cultural events. Whether you seek dancing, drinks, or cultural experiences, there's something for everyone. Number 28, prostitution in Canada. Prostitution itself is legal in Canada, but there are strict regulations surrounding it. While selling sexual services is permitted, buying these services is illegal, and activities such as operating a brothel or engaging in street prostitution are heavily regulated to ensure safety and reduce exploitation. Number 27, festivals. Canada is rich in festivals and events. Highlights include the Toronto International Film Festival, Montreal's Jazz Festival, and Ottawa's Winterlude, each offering unique experiences and attracting global audiences. Number 26, Quebec City. Founded in 1608, Quebec City is one of North America's oldest European settlements. 
Its captivating blend of historic architecture, including the iconic Chateau Frontenac, and vibrant Francophone culture has earned it UNESCO World Heritage status. Number 25. Cold Climate Canada's winters are notoriously cold, particularly in northern regions where temperatures can plunge below minus 40 degrees Fahrenheit. Areas like Yukon, Northwest Territories, and parts of Quebec and Ontario experience extreme winter conditions, making them some of the coldest places in the country. Number 24. National Beverage The Caesar, Canada's national cocktail, was created in 1969 by Walter Chell in Calgary. This popular drink combines vodka, clamato juice, hot sauce, and Worcestershire sauce, garnished with a celery stalk and lime. The Caesar is renowned for its savory, tangy flavor and is a staple in Canadian brunches. Number 23. Telephone Invention Alexander Graham Bell, a Canadian resident, invented the telephone on March 10, 1876, revolutionizing global communication by enabling voice transmission over long distances. Bell's work was conducted in Boston, but he was a Canadian citizen, which contributes to his significant legacy in both countries. Number 22. People Leaving Canada People are leaving Canada due to the high cost of living in cities like Toronto and Vancouver, long healthcare wait times, and the pursuit of better job prospects. Rent and housing prices have surged significantly, rising by 8 to 10 percent annually, making it increasingly unaffordable for many Canadians to stay in the country. Number 21. Milk in bags. In Ontario and Quebec, milk is often sold in one-liter plastic bags, a practice that began in the 1970s to reduce packaging waste. While it has become a familiar sight for locals, it often surprises visitors to Canada. Number 20. National Sports Ice hockey, Canada's national winter sport, and lacrosse, its national summer sport, are deeply rooted in Canadian culture and history. Both sports have produced world-class athletes and continue to captivate fans across the country. Number 19. Trans-Canada Highway Spanning over 7,800 kilometers, the Trans-Canada Highway is the longest national highway connecting all 10 provinces from the Pacific to the Atlantic. This iconic roadway is a vital transportation corridor offering breathtaking scenery and access to countless communities along its route. Number 18. Lakes and Freshwater Canada, with an estimated 2 million lakes, has more lakes than any other country, containing about 20% of the world's freshwater. From the Great Lakes to countless smaller ones, these lakes are vital to Canada's ecology, economy, and recreation. Number 17. Mountain Ranges Canada's mountains are a playground for outdoor enthusiasts. The majestic Canadian Rockies in the west and the lush Laurentian Mountains in the east offer countless opportunities for hiking, camping, skiing, and snowboarding. Number 16. Donuts is love. Canadians consume the most donuts per capita globally. A significant contributor to this sweet obsession is Tim Hortons, a beloved coffee and baked goods chain founded in 1964, which has become synonymous with Canadian donut culture. Number 15. Cuisine. Canadian cuisine is a vibrant blend of cultural influences. Iconic dishes like poutine and Nanaimo bars are just part of a diverse culinary landscape shaped by indigenous, French, British, and immigrant traditions, offering a rich variety of tastes across the country. Number 14. Craft Dinner Canadians consume more craft dinner, or KD, per capita than any other country, making it a staple comfort food. This iconic macaroni and cheese product is particularly popular among students and busy families due to its affordability and quick preparation. Number 13. Niagara Falls Niagara Falls, straddling the Canada-US border, is a world-renowned natural wonder. Featuring Horseshoe Falls, American Falls, and Bridal Veil Falls, it draws millions of visitors annually with its powerful cascades, mist, and rainbows. Number 12. Toronto 
Toronto, Canada's largest city, has over 2.7 million residents and serves as the country's economic and cultural hub, known for its iconic skyline, world-class museums, and vibrant multicultural scene. It attracts visitors from around the globe. Number 11. CN Tower The CN Tower in Toronto, completed in 1976, was the world's tallest freestanding structure for 32 years. It offers stunning 360-degree views of the city and remains a top attraction for visitors and locals. Number 10. Life Expectancy Canada boasts one of the highest life expectancies globally, with citizens enjoying an average lifespan of around 82 years, reflecting the country's high standards of living and health care. Number 9. Biodiversity. Canada's diverse geography, from Arctic tundra to Pacific rainforests, supports rich wildlife including grizzly and polar bears, whales and migratory birds, making it a global leader in biodiversity. Number 8. Waterton Lakes. Waterton Lakes National Park in Alberta and Montana's Glacier National Park together form the Waterton Glacier International Peace Park. Known for its pristine lakes, stunning mountains, and diverse wildlife, it offers hiking, boating, and wildlife viewing, and is a UNESCO World Heritage Site. Number 7. Famous Beaches Canada features diverse and stunning beaches. From Wasaga Beach, the world's longest freshwater beach, to Prince Edward Island's red sand dunes and coastal towns. With pristine sands, clear waters, and abundant wildlife, these beaches offer a chance to relax and explore Canada's natural beauty. Number 6. Major Cities Canada's urban landscape is centered in Ontario, Quebec, and Alberta. These provinces house the five largest cities, Toronto and Ottawa in Ontario, Montreal in Quebec, and Calgary and Edmonton in Alberta, serving as major economic, cultural, and transportation hubs. Number 5. Natural Resources Canada is a global powerhouse in mineral and energy resources, boasting significant reserves and production of uranium, zinc, nickel, titanium, diamond, copper, lead, gold, silver, iron ore, coal, and petroleum. These resources contribute substantially to the nation's economy. Number 4. Economy Canada, with a GDP over 2 trillion US dollars, has a robust and diversified economy. Key sectors include natural resources, manufacturing, and growing technology industries like software, AI, and biotechnology. Number 3. Beer Consumption Canadians average 78 liters of beer per person annually. The country has a vibrant craft beer scene with diverse breweries producing innovative brews, complementing the dominant larger breweries and offering numerous options for enthusiasts. Number 2. Tourism in Canada Canada's tourism industry is a major economic driver, with millions of visitors flocking to experience its diverse landscapes, vibrant cities and warm hospitality each year. In 2023, Canada welcomed approximately 18.3 million international visitors. Number 1. Best Time to Visit Canada Canada's best visit times depend on your interests. Spring from April to May and fall from September to October offer mild weather and fewer crowds. Summer from June to August is great for outdoor activities and city life. And winter from December to March is ideal for winter sports. Now, did you know why Burger King in Australia is known as Hungry Jack's? Bet you didn't. Click the video on your left and I'll see you in Australia.